prison is supposed to be a place where criminals are punished by having privileges and basic rights stripped from them. But you'd be surprised at just how much one can do while incarcerated. Here are 10 things you didn't know prisoners get to have behind bars. Before we walk down to lock up, show us your appreciation for the richest by hitting that subscribe button. Adult Entertainment Most adults enjoy adult entertainment in some form, regardless of whether or not they're in a relationship or single. It's a simple human thing that we all enjoy and a prison in Belgium recognizes that need. The prison gives inmates the chance to pay a monthly fee to join a program called Prison Cloud, and it allows inmates to watch adult entertainment. It allows the inmates to be treated more humanely and helps them deal with their stress by giving them something more related to normal life. Healthcare It might annoy some to hear that prison inmates actually have better access to healthcare than law-abiding citizens who have never been behind bars. Prisons make living a healthy lifestyle part of prison regulations with access to regular checkups and medication needed to live. There was an alarming study released saying that inmates are more likely to die upon release than behind bars due to having better access to medical care. Video Games There are people who can't even afford a video game console because they are so expensive. But if you're an inmate in the United Kingdom, you might be lucky enough to be in one of the prisons that provide video gaming entertainment. But not just anyone can have access to video games. They must be earned with good behavior and a strong establishment of trust. Also, the consoles aren't the latest and don't have internet access, if that makes the situation better. Studies have shown that inmates who play video games are less likely to get in fights. Tablets we know what you're thinking. Not everyone can afford a tablet, so why should inmates have access to them? But if rehabilitation and survival going back into society is the goal, then prisons must keep up with technology. There are companies such as Adobo and JPay that create tablets just for inmates, who can use the devices to talk to family via email, take classes, and watch videos. This also keeps the inmates out of trouble and gives them a tool to help them transition back to society upon their release. Subscription-based TV It's no surprise that there is television in prison, but it's more like regular cable television with limited access to programming. There was some controversy in the UK after it was discovered that thousands of privately run prisons had access to a subscription-based program known as Sky. Given that there were thousands of regular citizens that can't afford Sky, you can imagine the outrage when it was discovered that inmates could access special shows, sports events, and movies. Animals This might be one of the most beautiful privileges available in prisons today. There are programs all over the world that are allowing inmates to adopt dogs and cats. The inmates then spend their own money to take care of their furry friend and have even learned skills like reading so they can be better care providers. In Washington State, the Perfect Pals organization has a program where inmates can foster kittens and shy adult cats that would otherwise be euthanized, thus saving the kitty and helping the inmates make better choices in their lives. MP3 Players Music is one of those things that is enjoyed by people universally. It would be hard to meet one person who doesn't listen to any kind of music because with so many genres there is literally something for everyone, even if they're in prison. While it would be expected for inmates to have something old like a disc player or a Walkman, inmates can actually purchase an MP3 player and download music from a list of 1 million approved songs. Of course, anything with explicit language or violence is banned. Sweets and Snacks You might get some satisfaction knowing that criminals are eating less than stellar food while in the slammer, but psychologically, inmates can't eat terrible food all the time or their moods will get volatile, increasing the risk for disagreements and violence. In most prison commissaries, inmates have access to delicious snacks and treats like brand name candy and snacks, plus cups of noodles. The inmates must pay for these snacks and treats themselves and are usually more expensive. Recreational Equipment 
In Norway, not only do inmates live in bungalows instead of cells, but they also have access to recreational equipment like fishing and skiing gear. Like with video games, having access to this recreational equipment is based on good behavior and making sure the guards can trust you. Not to mention, the inmates must pay for this gear as well. Why have these privileges? They help the inmates prepare for life back in society and help them stay physically fit. Sewing Kids Sewing is harmless enough until you remember it requires sharp needles. Inmates have a lot of time to kill, which they can pass with recreational activities, reading, and basic arts and crafts. However, if an inmate has proven themselves to be a model inmate with good behavior, they can have access to art supplies like canvas, nicer paints, and brushes. If an inmate is really good and shown to be rehabilitated, they can have access to sewing kits and knitting. But they have to be trusted to handle the sharp items without hurting themselves or others. So, does prison seem that bad after all? Still don't want to go there, trust us. Tell us what you thought of this video in the comments, give us a thumbs up, and check out these other videos on The Richest. Thanks for watching.